Hey guys, welcome back to another Mod Bros video. I'm Tucker. Today I'm going to be talking about my bird of prey. You've all seen, or hopefully you've all seen, Chris Cartea's bird of prey. Mine is based on that. It's very similar. It has just a normal star shot body with an Apollo plunger tube. Um, I upgraded the springs in it. It's now um, hitting about 200 FPS or just under it. I gave it a brass breech, 916 to so 1732nd barrel. Uh, I have future plans for it. I want to be hitting at least 250 with this and give it a nice paint job, make it look real clean, real nice. Um, I would like to put a laser pointer down here because it's just unused space at the moment. Um, I know there was a laser pointer down there when it was fully stocked, but I want one that I can easily see people across the field with during my wars. A bit of a difficult pull, but of course that's no not really too much of a trade-off for the amount of power that you're getting out of such a small package. Um, it's just a nice little one-shot you just load it in right here and then you you shoot it. It does sometimes have a scar on it but that only increases the accuracy just a little bit it's shooting pretty close to dead on already and the scar just slows it down. I'm going to go do a quick range test to show you guys the power um, at its current state. This is just a quick range test as always three darts from this spot down range. All right, let's go see where those landed. So all three darts landed at just about the first tree. And if you remember Jacob's Kronos' video with the single shot barrel from a couple days ago, you would remember it was going to the second tree. So obviously the performance is just a little bit better with his. And I still wanna upgrade this a bit more so it's hitting like 250. But that's just the range test. You guys saw what it was. It's pretty good for what it's shooting at. Of course, I want it to be better. Who doesn't want their stuff to get better? In case you guys were wondering, my cameraman during this video was my little brother. He'll be having a couple videos coming out soon. I don't have Jacob today because he's out playing uh, Ultimate Frisbee down in Vegas. As with most of my blasters, I name them. And with this one, it's called Fukuro, which is owl in Japanese. And I thought it was kind of fitting since it's a bird of prey and an owl is a bird of prey. All right, guys, all I have left to say about this is that I just have this nice little airsoft holster that Jacob and I found one day when we were at Dart Wars. It holsters it real nicely, fits right on my side, and it's just a great little holster for my bird of prey. I'm going to give it a paint job very, very soon. You guys will see that up on the Instagram. I highly recommend making a bird of prey for yourself. It's really fun, really powerful, really accurate, and it's just a nice, simple build. All you have to do is get a nice size plunger tube. It doesn't have to be an Apollo plunger tube, and just cut it so it'll fit inside the shell. It's a pretty easy thing to use. You guys will like it. I like it. And I hope you guys will tune into the next video. Like, comment, and subscribe. And see you next time.